Hey guys, welcome to another video. So, Blox News has recently tweeted that all users on Roblox are now able to use and enable a two factor authentication app of your choice, which means you can um, access your Roblox account from a two, fac a two step app. And to enable it, you got you head to my settings and then privacy, which you can see right here. I click uh, security actually, it's security, not privacy. And then it should say to uh, receive codes from an authenticator app to confirm your identity. So in uh instead of getting email codes to confirm your identity to log into your Roblox account, you can uh, uh receive codes from a, a verified authenticator app to confirm your identity. So then you can log on to Roblox. These are both two-step verification um things to protect your Roblox account from getting hacked. To kind of prevent your Roblox account from getting hacked, but you still can get hacked. But here are some two-factor authenticator apps that you guys can use. So, first up, I searched up two-factor authenticator apps. And what is the best two-factor authentication app? First one is Authy. Authy does it all. It's easy to use, supports TLTP, and even comes with encrypted backups. Next up, we have the Google Authenticator. And it is the app that has started it all, and it still works really great today. And one that I would suggest is the Microsoft Authenticator because I've tried it before, it's pretty good. It's easy to set up. And here we're, we're gonna go look at Authy since it seems like Authy is the, the first best and it's free, available across all platforms and easy to use and its security features are better than those of other two-factor authenticator apps. So if you guys are looking for a really good two-factor authenticator app, which is free and easy to use then Authy is the one which will be linked down in the description and yeah so Roblox has just improved the security by adding a authenticator setup here we're going to take a look at this guy who's having a problem So when you set up your authenticator, it says authenticator setup, and I believe it says enter the manual entry key above into your authenticator, then enter the generated code below. You have to enter the top code right here, which you can see I'm circling with my mouse, into your authenticator app, and then probably like enter or something, and then a generated code should pop up, and you just type it in, and it should verify, and it should activate. And to this guy that's having this problem, I don't think he's going to be able to see my video, but that's how you enable it, I guess. I think you just type that into, you just manual and en uh, enter that into your authenticator app. Um, yeah, and then you should get a code, type it in, verify, and it should, uh, it should let you toggle it. Which means when you log into a, uh, your Roblox account from a device that has uh, currently been logged in and logged out, or from a new device, you'll be sent a uh, code, probably either through your email or your authenticator app, whichever one you chose. Um, uh, it sends you a code that you can uh, type into Roblox to verify, and I think an authenticator app is really um a better choice because emails people can gain access to your emails and possibly find out your roblox account password change your roblox account password and i don't really think that's kind of safe but for now i'm going to use email codes but if you retrieve these codes from an authenticator app it's pretty much more safer and more secure because it's going to be really hard for somebody to gain access to uh, your account through an authenticator app since authenticator apps are uh, protected and it's really hard to gain access to accounts that are on authenticator apps. 
Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and uh, I just went over that all users are now able to enable two-factor authentication using an external authenticator app of your choice, like the Authy app, Google Authenticator, all of these here. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I'll see you guys in another video, and bye.